Hi everyone, welcome to this structural BIM tutorial and today I'm going to take a look at how we can work with the augmented reality app Augin. So first and foremost I'm going to go to my web browser and this is the website um, aug.in.app um, if you just search Augin um, it will take you direct to it and this is an augmented reality app um, and first and foremost I'm going to download a plugin and you can see that we've got plugins for Revit, SketchUp and TQS. If we jump into the download plugin for Revit, it takes you to this screen. So I'm just going to enter my name, say I'm an architect, select a state and just enter that simple sum. Um, and then I'm going to click download and just make sure I correct the sum. Download plugin, you get this message, um, click OK to it then it will browse to a zip file. So if we go to my desktop, and I'm gonna save and zip that file into that location. I'm then going to have a look, and I'm gonna extract all the documentation within, and then double click into it, and then I get this MSI file for Revit 2020. So I'm just gonna run it, and I'm going to run anyway click next it's going to install it in that position click next and it should be relatively simple and quick and straightforward to quickly install the plugin on top of Revit so we'll just wait and let that run through and now I'm just going to enter my security details And it's done. Now if I go to my desktop and I launch Revit 2020, we should have this plugin added to the system. So I'm just going to verify that it is the plugin. You can see that it's the Augin plugin. I'm going to always load and it should now launch Revit as per normal. I'm going to open up a previous tutorial that I've done, which is one of my Revit Grand Designs. And there we have it. So I'm in the 3D view. I'm going to look to my Login tab. I can click Login. I'm going to log in using my email address. And then my password. <clears throat> I'm successfully logged in. We'll click OK. And then what I can do is send the current view. So I click send. And off it will do and upload this Revit project into the application so you can see that successfully uploaded I'll receive an email once it's fit for viewing so once I've uploaded the model I've now got the app downloaded so I click the app and you can see that under my organ you will see down the bottom left is my Revit file that I have just uploaded so I can click the file and you can see that it gives me some controls of how I can rotate and zoom in and out so you can see I can rotate the model there and I can zoom and I can do all the usual stuff within a viewer but the really cool thing is down the bottom of the screen you will see I've got augmented reality so I click that it will now begin to load the device 
So what you do is you move the device left and right to find the surface. So I'm going to touch the plane where I want to land the model. I'm going to zoom out. I'm going to rotate the model around. So you can see what I now have is I can just pinch the screen and make the model a little bit bigger. So now as I'm looking at my Revit screen here, I've also got the augmented reality of the app and the model right in front of me. So how cool is that? Really simple. Download the software, install the plugin, and now I've got augmented reality on my desk.